remember the days All those years ago that never fade away And I remember your face When you hit the ground I can recall the time and place On a midnight walk Through the old streets Trying to turn back the clock to the days of old Back to the days when all the things we knew were made of gold As the world moves on Time sings a song oh, oh. In the old neighborhood As the clock strikes one The memory lives just as it stood Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. We have some very, very, very exciting news today. Oh, by the way, I'm wearing a Bro Bunny Housewife crew, but we did restock the Navy crew and the pink crew. Well, the Navy set and the pink crew for a very limited time. So for those of you guys who have been requesting that, I will have it linked below. You need to order them now because they're not gonna be available for that long and this is the only time we're restocking. And that Navy set, I have been asked to restock, like I'm not kidding, a thousand times. So I will have it linked below. Anyways, today's video is very exciting because as you guys can see, I am moving. I am gonna take y'all through a little bit of a story time of how I got the house, and then I also filmed a little sneak peek of the house during the inspection. I filmed myself touring all of the homes in a recent week of my life vlog, so you guys can go watch that as well. And then I also filmed myself when I found out I got the house, and then like calling people and stuff. So you guys will see all that. Hello? Kenzie. Yeah? Oh, you're gonna cry. What? Here's a joy, you got the house no way oh my god this is so this is my day oh my god oh my god i'm so excited yay to you and also we'll get the inspection and all that done asap during auction so we can just have everything covered our t's crossed our i's dotted and then we can go back and go through it all oh my god amazing yay Hello. I got the house. You got it? Yeah, I'll Ooh. send it to you. It's oh so much nicer than the last house. It's like unbelievable. Oh. I got the house. Ooh, shut up. I know. So I'm so happy. I oh. Guess what? What? I got the house. <gasps> oh my god. I know. You have a room. You finally have a room. I have a bed. Uh, oh my god, Kimby, I have a bedroom! I'm so, so excited! So anyways, I was looking for a new home. I wasn't set on moving immediately. Basically, I was gonna move whenever I found like the perfect house. I honestly wasn't even planning on moving like this year, but things just like kept happening and I was like, I really need a bigger space. I need a guest bedroom. I need a place for a podcast studio. I need a yard. I don't want stairs anymore. I maybe even want like more peace and quiet. So like a different area, even though I love this townhouse and I love the neighborhood and it's like been the best thing ever for me. Like literally the best thing ever. I'm, I don't know, I haven't decided. I was really set on renting it, but now I like kind of want to sell because I don't really feel like having to, we'll see. I, I don't know what's gonna happen with the townhouse. And when I was looking for a new home, I was like, this is like the, I was trying to think about it in a way of like, this is the life that I want to live. This is how I want to feel. And as much as I love being in the middle of everything right now, and it's been awesome for like going out and whatever, uh, and I also like wanted to stay in Dallas regardless like, I, I either want to go like literally on a ranch in the middle of nowhere Which is like the dream or like stay in the city I don't really I have no interest in like suburbs So I was like I'm set on moving in the city But I wanted to explore different areas that were like cozier a little more quaint I got my heart broken by this dream house that I just happened to come across put in an offer I got beat out by a cash offer. They're literally thieves and I was gonna go watch her on their ass. They're I'm kidding for legal reasons this is a joke but they're lucky that i found a way better house because now i'm over it and i don't care anymore i was touring with my realtor i didn't even think i would like it this is the house that i was really not interested in because i didn't want like a super like modern looking home i wanted more of like a traditional cozy house um but we walked in and it was so much better in person than it was on the photos and i was like this is the house like it's perfect for hosting it's in the perfect area it has a yard it has this like whole like outdoor space for hosting 
Um, there's room for to build a guest house or a studio like everything that I needed was in this house and I got it Which is really obviously very exciting. All right guys I just got a tape measure. I'm going to the inspection and I'm going to start Measuring some things. Oh my god. My closing is only two weeks out. So a lot is happening here um, There we go got some pens. I've got a notepad I am literally Bob the Builder. Going to the inspection now. Gonna give you guys a little sneak peek of the house. We're here, they're getting the inspection done right now. I love the area. This is my favorite part of the house. I'm getting some measurements right here. The master is insane. The bathroom is so beautiful. I'll probably replace these eventually, but like, stunning. I just noticed this closet, unreal. So it'll most likely be like this back corner that will be made the guest house, that will be a studio, somehow here. It'll be big enough. It's probably just gonna take up like this part of the yard. And also have this grass. So I will be moving. I wanted to like just share a little update before all the vlogs come um, and just say like I am so grateful for y'all because I wouldn't be like I would have won nothing in my life if it weren't for y'all, but like and I mean that in like the friendships that I have and the experiences that I have in the podcast and the brand, like obviously my YouTube channel, like Rebelling House of like everything I've been able to do and so many of like the friends and people in my life that mean the most to me, I've met through all of this stuff and I'm just like so grateful for y'all like I really am living like my dream life that I didn't even know existed and I owe everything to y'all and I'm so excited and I'm just I don't know I just love you guys so much and I'm so 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 grateful like I cannot even express it enough I am so grateful and I could say it for like an hour straight but I feel like that's gonna get annoying so I will stop but just know I love you guys and I'm so grateful for everyone who watches my videos and follows me on Instagram like listens to the podcast and all that stuff and like I hope that I feel like a friend or like a big sister or just a friend honestly like I don't know I feel like maybe I don't not in like a big sister in the way of like um I'm telling you what to do or whatever but in the way of like don't do what I did in certain areas you know I'm just so grateful and I love y'all and there's gonna be so many moving vlogs so I close um like early march this happened very quickly like so fast i'm in the middle of traveling a ton as i'm filming this i'm going to nashville for the live show when i get back is when i close and then i move i just start packing like this weekend as i'm recording this it's just really hectic it's very crazy this is why i've been so overwhelmed and i am just so excited this house is literally a dream like an actual dream and you guys will die you will love it you will be like this is the best thing i've ever seen it's gonna make all of my content look even better too because the lighting is unbelievable so anyways i love you guys i am moving i'm very excited and we will be vlogging the entire process so subscribe for the moving vlogs i love you guys so much and i will talk to you in my next video bye there's a thing about running into any sort of ex and trust me i have this down to a t because i do it do. all the time you immediately go up to them, keep it short and sweet, say, yeah. hi, how are you? Whatever, nice, leave, you're good. Make it not weird, short and sweet, so they're like, oh, fuck, or like, you know what I mean, afterwards.